Okay, this is version 12.3, and it really should pull up here and turn on red, but it's not. So I'm going to tap the accelerator. I'm going to let it know that it can turn on red because it all of a sudden does not turn on red. And I don't know what, what that's all about because it used to turn on red all the time. And I've noticed uh, with version 12, in certain circumstances, if you're at a traffic light, it will not turn bright on red. Even if a right hand turn on red is allowed. The intersection we're coming up on, if it was going to make a right-hand turn, would really get messed up. If it came this way and was making a turn, a left-hand turn up there, it could not do it. Version 12.3 is able to do that without any problems whatsoever. And so far, this drive has been flawless. I'm not really happy if it does a 34 on the other side of the bridge here because it is 25. It slowed up for the people. Look at that right away. Perfect. Uh, because this is really residential and I don't want it to exceed the 25 mile an hour speed limit. It is doing 26 right now. Here is where 25 starts, I believe. It used to hog the center of that lane also, 12.3 has fixed that in the sense that it knows we're making a right-hand turn, it drives on the right-hand side rather than to pick the middle of the road because it's not marked. All of the complaints that I really had about FSD have been really repaired. I mean, is it perfect? No, it's not perfect yet. but. Um, it certainly got, got here quicker than I ever thought it would get here based on the progress we were making up to version 12. It's incredible. You might not be able to tell from the videos, but you can tell by the way it feels riding as a passenger or the driver, technically. Now, most people would not stop here because they wouldn't. They'd look, they realize there was no traffic and whatever. 